Hey everybody, Rion the Roko here, back with more Fire Emblem Radiant on Iron Man. I was gonna say fun run, I had to stop myself. Gonna get right into the chapter here because we set it all up last time. So let's see how many of these green units we can save. Now, kind of have Vika set up in a position where she can bait the wyvern. Um, trying to think how you do this. Does she, she, does she do enough damage where she would actually threaten him? Nine? I don't know if she gets beak when she's kicking. I don't think she does. So I think it's just nine. So there's no way she does damage to this guy, right? She doesn't do damage to him. So in theory... If he hits her, the problem is he has to hit her. What do you got? 113 versus. He's not telling me her. Oh, wait, there's her boy. Uh, 59. So she cuts his accuracy basically in half. There's a 50 50 shot, he hits her and gets her the rest of the gauge she needs to transform. I think what I need is I need. Tormod to take out the Wyvern. He can't make it. He shouldn't need... Does he need Elfire, or can I go for the accuracy? I mean, it's not a huge accuracy difference. And 17 magic alone probably kills this guy two times over. Yeah, 17... Yeah, he can use fire for the accuracy. Alright, I think what we're gonna do... Shove Tormod. There we go. I'm gonna fly over here and we'll have to grass up on the next turn. We'll have Mirarum here. I think we'll just take a grassy terrain and we'll let him punch this guy. Meanwhile, I'm gonna get to you guys later actually. I wanna. There's a lot of thought that has to go into these guys, so we'll. The real question is, how do we do this? Because Raphael can barely move, so there's no way for him to vigor Nyla and or Volug this turn. I think his best option is to start heading this way, once I clear this path out, because then he'll be more in range to help more people. These fire mages? No, thunder mages. Yep, because they got the little semi-cape. How's Volug fair? He does have... Yeah, he, he got a strength strike, so he does pretty good damage. He should be able to kill these guys, right? Oh yeah, Bolu does just fine, aside from the fact that I think they're all 1-2 range. Javelin, Thunder, Thunder... I guess these guys aren't. I like... How much food do you guys got? Nine apiece, right? Should be nine apiece, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wait. Oh, do they not take train penalty? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, they don't take train penalty. That's awesome. I did I thought wolves take a little bit of train penalty, but apparently not. So what's your res? Seven, yeah, I think we want the mages dead first, if we can help it. So for me, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. He should be able to make it to the other mage if I have Nyla take this one out. Even Nyla's a vicious savage tearing people's faces off. They're all way too into Moon Knight. Kudos to anyone who actually understands what I mean when I'm saying that, because most people don't know what I'm talking about. They're gonna be like, what do you mean? Moon Knight never tore anyone's face off in the TV show? I'm like, read the comics. Moon Knight is fucking savage in the comics. He literally carved the dude's face off. Then he wore it around as a mask because the dude's insane. But... I... Uh... Can I tag team him? I mean, I guess, but... I don't really have good accuracy. I don't even think Kai had good accuracy. 84 is pretty good, I guess. Um, I could run Zyhark down here, but then he has to come all the way back up here. And Zyhark's... Well, I guess Soth could come up here. Maybe I should have had Nolan come down here. How does he fare against this guy? Still can't double. What a shock. 
Oh, he does have Venonax. I gotta be a little weary of that. Soth kills him? No. I think it's gotta be Zyhark, sadly. He needs to go Killing Edge even just to have a shot. I don't want to do it, but I think it's my best shot to get rid of this guy. Nice. Okay, not so nice. We're not getting the crit. Dodge. There we go. But we got the kill, thanks to the Adept. Okay, okay, okay. Um... Um, um, um. Can you one-shot anybody over here? No. We probably tag team this guy with. Uh, we could if we can hit. Can you one-shot this guy for me? Yeah. He actually doubles. Wow. Look at that, Nolan doubling. It it can be happen. The problem is this guy's still gonna be alive. Can Soth kill this guy for me? Okay, Soth can kill that guy. Okay, so what if we have Soth here? I know it's melee, but whatever, we'll deal with it, just because we can body block. So Soth kills this guy, Nolan kills this guy. Or, actually, no, 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 no. What we do is we... We experiment, because we still have the, the spot open for Soth to come and fight this guy, if, if Ileana Makai is, aren't enough. If this combo isn't enough, then Soth can come in and finish it off. Alright, Micaiah, you have 100%. You can't fuck it up. Nuclear Liliana was the only one who fucked this up. Watch her miss somehow, anyways. FE uh, 6, 7, and 8 on the GBA, where you could actually miss. Actually, I actually think it was only 6 you could miss on 100. I think they fixed it in the other two. But it was possible to mix due to a rollover. Okay, so we have Nolan stand here, and Soth stand here. We can still body block. And I think we just sh take out the mage, probably for Nolan's sake. Yeah, we leave the one guy with the Venonax, but I think we just deal with that. If he hits, he hits. Poison's not that big a deal. So there we go, body blocking. Knife that guy. Alright, alright. We're doing good. Good first turn, good first turn. Oh, Raphael has moved, that's right. I can start moving him in this direction. Get him caught up with the rest of everyone else here. Alright, good first turn, good first turn. Hey, that guy took his one step forward. Good for him. It's okay. Volu just wants to get in wrath range, guys. It's it's okay. He knows what he's doing. Trust him. Dodge. Nice. Alright, well, there's the Wyvern dead. There is one more, if I recall. Hall. I think they have one more in a reinforcement wave. I'm pretty sure they got one more, but... Yeah, the Dawn Brigade, thankfully, doesn't fight that many wyverns. Oh no, I'm poisoned. I'm more poisoned. Oh, they're like, don't worry, we'll help Volu build his strike rank. And get him closer to, to wrath range. Also, Volute doesn't two-shot these guys. A little unfortunate. The Brigands do have a shitload of HP, though, in this game. Volute going for that essence. Oh, shit! He snuck by me! Oh, god, I think I just lost the run. No, Makai lives. Oh, my god, and a dodge. What, what miracle of science is this? And she doesn't get doubled because she's fast enough. Holy shit. Holy shit. Dude, I felt my balls recede into my body when that brigand moved right there. 
I thought the run was over, and in all honesty, it probably should have been. How did he not kill 19? Holy crap. Thank God Venonax has no might. I guess she could have, in theory, died from the poison if she did get hit, but... Oh. That was that was way too close. That was way too close. I'm still shaking. Um, actually, it's probably easier for you to just cross the damn swamp at this point. Let's go over here. Gauge up. Marum, he's got healing, so we're just gonna let him sit there and punch that guy. Unfortunately, I really wish they'd gain gauge if they dealt damage. I hate how it's like, oh, if you get attacked while you're not engaged, and you take damage, and you don't deal damage in return, you get gauge. But if you deal damage, you get no gauge. Like, why? Why? Um, we gotta take out the range guy here so the rest of them kind of just drop dead as they fight. Nice. You don't need it, but it's great, nonetheless. Alright, Volug. He doesn't like being poisoned. I don't want this guy to heal the brigands. Let's take him out. I did leave a Vuln on Volug. I'm like... 99% sure. Okay, he's got a fall on his time. Alright, so how's that strike rank going? We're getting there. We're like 10% of the way to SS strike. Alright, uh, Zyhark, 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 Zyhark. Um, yeah, I think you just have to start working your way this way. Alright, Micaiah. I'm gonna let you finish this one only because you dodged. Like, you deserve this kill. You did so well, I'm so proud of you. How are we doing on levels, by the way? We level 11? Oh, almost 12. We're getting there. We're getting there. Um, we got bonus XP, so we, should, we can probably get her like 15 ish in that ballpark um, on the next chapter. Nolan can't really participate. Do they have. One guy has a hand axe. This guy does not have a javelin. Alright, this time we gotta... Let's make sure we actually body block. Use the, nu the knife that actually has uh, some uses on it so it doesn't break halfway through the enemy turn. Oh wait, where's Raphael's movement? Oh, just shy. I guess I could have moved Ileana there and then got her to, I guess like here, but. Could have done it to Laura, but not really worth it. Laura's not really doing anything. We get everybody. I think we got everybody except for Mararim, who is more than enough HP. I don't feel bad about healing, not healing him. All right, Volug. Here comes the next round of attacks, but luckily Venonaxes have no damage. So close, and yet so far. Oh, look at that XP. Go Mararam. We're gonna get him a level up for sure at this rate. Wait, oh, they're walking towards the other healer? Are you kidding me? Healing AI, they're like, we can go all the way across the entire swamp. Oh, you do damage, no! She does damage! Now she doesn't get gauge. I didn't even check that, I was just like, there's no way she does damage. She's Vika, what, like, how does she do damage? Oh, no. Now she doesn't have gauge. I don't think she, she wouldn't have been able to transform anyways on my turn. But... Now she's that much farther off. Can you double? No one double? Nope. No one can't double. Double this guy? Probably not. It's Nolan. He was probably just on the cusp of doubling that mage that he doubled. He probably couldn't even double the other one. 
Oh look, more mer things for Moran to punch. Ooh, does the poison get me gauge? Oh, so close. Okay, he can't reach. He can't reach the uh, the peasant here. So I could fly out of his range. Um, I don't have to olive grass because that's kind of a waste. We'll just let her get gauge for the next turn. Does she do enough damage when she's transformed to be 18 and 7? It's really 25. Twice on his 14 is. 9 damage twice. Holy shit, she takes forever to kill him. Um, it's a route, so I could... I could move him in range of the boss. He's not too threatened by the boss, I don't think. Yeah, he takes a bit of damage, actually. Maybe not such a good idea. Can you rescue him? No. That's unfortunate. Um... Ooh, 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 wait, 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 wait. I know how we do it. Okay. We'll bring Raphael down here. We'll bring her over here. We don't need to olive grass. Let's turn him back on. So... Go here. May as well herb, why not? Okay, so in theory, what happens is he moves here. We come down here, and we hit him twice. We don't kill him, but we do some damage, and we have... I believe she has nine moves, so we go one, two, three, four, five. Raphael dances, and she comes back and gets the kill. Oh yeah, that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. We figured it out. We got our plan. Micaiah get another kill, maybe? Oh my god, look at this. Micaiah getting kills. I mean, it's not hard when people are setting off for her, but... Nuclear I probably could have and should have sacrificed, but by killing this guy, I can move my front line further ahead, which I think is more valuable. Speaking of moving my front line further ahead, you want to help out here? Jeez, this thunder magic sucks so bad. Oh, he has a crit. I thought that was my crit. Don't fuck this one up, Ileana. Can you... Can't reach Nolan unless maybe, maybe. There we go. Well, how far does Nolan get? Actually, no, never mind. That was that was a waste of Zyrex ability because I want to all of Makai sacrifice and get a level up. Soth, come down here. He's got knife set up. I don't think these. Yeah, these guys are all activated, so they can't reach. Marm punching people, and then we got wolves over here. All these guys are in healing AI, so I guess we'll just start picking them off like flies. Do we just give Strike Rank to Volu, let him kill all three? Maybe we just do that, we'll have Nyla run and try and catch up with the rest. Cause like, not like the brigands can outrun Volu, he can chase them down to the ends of the earth. Uh, we do have to be careful. This guy sees no one. I could move Mararm over here. Yeah, I'm gonna move Mararm over here just to make sure that they all see him. Because I don't want this guy to be like, Oh, I can't see anyone in range and start wandering off towards this villager. I guess Tormod's here so we can defend the villager, but... We're gonna do it that way anyways. Oh! I thought I was outside the boss's range. Oh, I turned him off, didn't I? Whoopsies. Oh well. Torment's okay. Torment's not okay, actually. If he crit, that would have killed him. Take that. Wait, he moved up, but he didn't heal? What? <laughs> Don't worry, boss. I'm here for you. You gonna heal me? No, no. I'm just here for you. I'm emotional support. Oh, there. I can transform to Tiger now. I don't know if I want to, at least not until he's in Resolve range. When he's in Resolve range, I can transform into Tiger and he becomes invincible. Okay, that guy wasn't in... Uh... Heal AI. Kinda weird, but whatever. Oh, wait, this guy just body blocked the other guy, so now he doesn't see Mararm. He's gonna go after a villager, isn't he? Yeah, he's gone after a villager. Arg. 
Oh, great, another one. That's fine, he's got many, many turns before he gets to a villager. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he's got many turns, so we can get Volug easily within that guy's range to stop him. Volug getting close to that Wrath range, we're almost there. Another... If we get, like, a three tick of poison, I think it puts him there. What range. Uh, he's got a few turns. We're fine. I could transform, but again, I don't really want to transform right now. 16 defense is kind of... I don't think I need the extra one defense. He takes a lot of damage. And what's his avoid drop to? 49... So it drops to 49, that's... I mean, the 49 is pretty good, but... 125 hit, really? Damn, he rolled a lot of skill. Good for him. Oh, you don't have healing. That's a little unfortunate, but there we're out the bo outside of the boss's range. All right, let's put our Vika plan into action, shall we? We transform. We beak this guy for 22 damage. And we probably dodge his attack. It's actually not, like, that great a dodge, honestly. It's kind of embarrassing for Vika to not have that good a dodge. Yeah, we'll fly. What do you got? You got five. Do I use your full moves? Vika's fine. She's got nine when she's transformed, right? I hate how you have to do it this way to find- Oh, she's only got eight when she's transformed. That's still fine from, like, here, though, right? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, she's fine. All right, we'll do this, just so that Raphael has a little bit less, uh, space he has to try and rip to cover to get back to everyone else. And right, we'll come back here. And finish this guy off. There's the dodge. fly over here. We might have to have Vika take out the boss, because if he does start chasing Tormod, I don't think Tormod can win that fight. Um, this guy's not going that far. Is there any way I can get into his range? Not really. Oh, wait. Nope. That's, that's not cover. Uh, why did you have to move here, dude? Why couldn't you just stand here? What if I moved up here and then backed into this spot on my next turn? I can maybe do that. Are they doing on HP? 32. What kind of damage are they doing? Five from this guy. Eleven in total with that guy. And... Sixteen in total. Half of my HP. We're fine. We're f wait, 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 wait. How many of them double? Okay, so 11, 1, 2. Okay, they. Okay, so these two guys double. So the two guys at 5. So it's actually 10, 20, 26 damage. I don't think poison can hit for 6. Also, he'll go into resolve range before that. Alright, we're gonna do it. Once he's in resolve range, we can transform him, and he's going to be a boss. All right, Nyla playing catch up. Oh, hey, we can talk. Boom! Give Makai the boost. She actually needed it. It looks like. All right, Nolan topped off, and we got the level up. Makai, want a good level up? Maybe, maybe. That's actually not terrible. I like the defense proc, at the very least. Very important proc. Actually, turn these guys off. I mostly want the, to make sure I don't accidentally aggro the boss with Nolan. Okay, Cyhark. I don't think we want to push Makaya further into the marsh. 
seems like a bad idea. Alright, so th to here with a knife, I think that'll work. How much evasions he's got in the uh, forest? 65, so he's at 75. These guys still have pretty good hit on him. Mages still have pretty good hit on him. Do I just pure water? 20 and 19. Oh, I don't have the pure water. Who's got my pure water? Did I take it off so? I mean, I did, obviously, but... Oh, that's right, he's got Seraphroak. Ooh, definitely don't let him die. More so than you normally don't let him die. They took the pure water off him, that's unfortunate. That'd be really nice right now, uh, 18 res. I'd feel a lot more confident going in against these guys. So 19 and 20... ...is 8 and 9. So 17 damage from those two. 24 on 15 is 18 more. 18 and 17 is 35? Am I doing the math right? Yeah, 35. So he lives. There's no venom weapons that I'm aware of. Crit chances. Crit of 5, 5, 7, 7. So they don't crit him. So as long as he's out of the boss's range, he should be fine. If they all hit, he's nearly dead, but he does live and there's no venom. So I think we're okay. To play aggressive like that. Nice dodge. Now we just clean house here. I don't know if so kills the soldiers actually, but at the very least he can set them up and we'll knock them down on the next turn. Plus we'll have Nolan nearby. Not one-shotting these mages, though, is a little unfortunate. The one in the grass kind of sort of makes sense. But he's not one-shotting the other one, who's not in defensive terrain. Right. Oh, we're getting there. Getting close to that resolve range. Nice dodge, nice dodge. Ooh, there we go. Oh, and he does kill, even if he didn't. That's good. Clean up some of these soldiers here. We can move in on the boss. I wonder if we do just use Vika. Like, have her pick him off, fly back near Raphael. Raphael dance for her, fly back and kill him. Be kind of fun, right? Didn't kill that guy, though. It's fine. He was thinking of Nolan, guys. He was like, I'll let Nolan have one kill. I mean, Nolan already had one. Oh, I have Resolve? Nice. Take that! I got resolve now. Oh shit, he's going the other way from. Wait, dude, come on, dude! Oh, there's the other wyvern. Alright, how far can he move? I might have to transform just to kill the wyvern. Yeah, we gotta kill the wyvern. Resolve, tiger! How much is it all? 50% I believe it is, right? Yeah, 50% more. So all the stats are 50% more, so... 18 more on top of strength. Holy shit, he's hitting like a truck. Wait, which stat? I don't think it does strength, though. Does it? No, it's strength, skill, and speed. Yeah, strength, skill, and speed. So his speed is 33. He's actually faster than Vika right now. Uh, his skill's insane. Yeah, strength is 40... or 52. 54 strength before claw <laughs> so he's got 64 attack right now yeah it seems pretty good seems like he can uh, kind of do whatever the hell he wants um i don't think you do enough damage to make poison threaten me four damage puts me yeah poison doesn't threaten me if you hit so go ahead let volu wrath crit you oh i can't dance vika this turn but I can hit and run. How much damage do you take? Oh, she kills. Uh, there is a little bit of a crit chance. Can I, uh... I can't heal her, though. 
What are these guys looking? Okay, they have they have sight on Tormod. Tormod out of there. Figure out where the boss is here. Oop. All right, Chris Nolan North. Er, uh, you could totally come in and kill him. It's that crit chance, though. 4% on a 46. It's not very likely, but it's there, and he does just enough. We need, like, we need three more HP. Alright, I'm gonna heal up, and then we'll have Olivia fly in. Or, Olivia. Vika fly in. I don't want to risk that crit. Can Soth reach? He can reach, but I think he dies, too. Uh, no crit, actually, so Soth could do it. I think we just give it to Vika, why not? We're, we're trying too hard. Otherwise, actually, let's have Soth back off. That's an easy, uh... That's an easy sacrifice target. Do -do -do. I don't even know what Zyhark's gonna do. He got the one kill. Even Nyla... Didn't make it here nearly as fast as I thought she would. I could dance for her. Bring her down here. Oh, shit. I probably could have danced for Vika, actually, because if I had flown back here... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... Yep, I'm an idiot. Vika could have done it this turn. Whoopsies. That's a my bad, guys. That's a my bad. Dude, should we, uh, should we put Resolve on Raphael, let him tank everything? He's unfortunately not very good at doing that, but... Do you get Strike Rank when you were... No, you don't really get much of Strike Rank when you're not engaged. Unfortunate. Would've been a great way to train him up. Wait, you do get Strike Rank, I thought, when you were untransformed. I thought you did. It doesn't look like he did, but I thought you did. I really don't know what to do with Nyla, because... Miraram just finishes off these three guys. Well, I took the Hand Axe guy, but he can do that next turn, because we're... We're kind of stuck here until the next turn, because Vika is... You know, not in position to, uh... No one can hit the villagers. Which is very important. Nyla can start walking across the swamp. I don't, I don't know. Oh yeah, this is also going to take an extra turn. Oh, no, because he's going to attack. He should attack um, Volug, and then I can kill him on player phase. T he he. Fools think you can challenge Mararim in resolve range? I'm pretty sure Mararim can... I don't know, he can't beat the Black Knight. There's no way he can beat him, but he can actually stand up to the Black Knight in resolve range like this. He'll die. He'll take two hits, but he can... He prevents the Black Knight from doubling with a 33 speed. And with 64 damage, he can actually do damage to the Black Knight. Oh, what? Oh, please don't know the Thunder Mages. Oh, Fire Mages. I should have left Nyla over there. Okay, so if he crits, we suffer 27 damage, but we're alive, so we're fine. So... I'd prefer if you don't crit, Vika. In fact, I'd really like you to miss, but if you do crit, I'm prepared for it. I don't think he's going to attack her because he kind of seems to be in healing AI mode. 
Arg, uh, we kinda need you to go over and help Volug, I think. Damn reinforcements. Wee. Oops. That's not what we wanted to do. Um, anyone? Yeah, I guess we can maybe try and get a sacrifice off on Tormod while we're waiting to kill all these enemies. No one want to take out a priest for me? Or do I give it to Vika? Does she want strike rank? I mean, she kind of does, but it's not really going to matter. Okay, I'm fortunate... Oh, there's a fire guy. Can you kill the fire guy in one hit? You do. Which is very important. But how much damage does this guy do? 19 on your 7 is 12. Yeah, that's pretty lethal. Let's, uh... Let's back up. Where's this guy? Okay, he can't reach a villager. That's fine. Actually, if we back up here and try and aggro him, I think he's going to go into healing AI mode, but... We can try and do that. Uh, Alright, we got to get rid of this hand axe guy, because I'm kind of sick of him looking at him. Oh no, it looks like Mararm can't kill him, but he can! Wait. Oh, is the 31 including the resolve? I didn't think it was including the resolve, because it... How did you do 31 damage? You should have a shitload damage. Like, a lot more damage than that. Okay, whatever. Let the enemy do their thing. Yeah, they're trying to heal. I need to get rid of that healer. Force them back into aggro mode. Can we get Pika a level up, maybe? Possibly. I mean, it might have to be a, a Bex level up if we get her to level up at all. Hey, the Tormod is going to make it out of the swamp. All right, we need to take out the Fire Mage. Can you reach anyone besides the Fire Mage? Yeah, you can reach whoever. Can you one-shot both the mages is the question. We know we can one-shot the Fire Mage. But yeah, he one-shots both of them. So we'll have uh, Nyla take out the Fire Mage. Let's go over here. Rip this guy's face off. Or not. Just gonna just gonna shoulder check him. This guy's still gonna be in heal mode because I left the priest alive. Do I really I mean I kinda wanna just give it to Vika, like just to try and get her another level up. She won't get it this chapter, but I guess I can get her to 15 on 10 E. God, Laura can barely move to save her life. There. She's out of the... the hazardous... well, not hazardous, but the difficult terrain. I love my dancer sitting here in the middle of bumfuck nowhere. It's beautiful. Alright, let's have you come up here. Hopefully nothing spawns behind me. Oh, oh, there's more wyverns. They got all the wyverns. I don't think you can kill a wyvern in one round. No. But, you know who can? The candy man can. Oh, he's got a hand axe. Alright. You know who can? The, the other guy. The candy man still can, just he wants to fight the other guy. I really should end this chapter, though. This is... I don't know what I'm doing dicking around like this. I could have ended this years ago. And I kept trying to, like, give kills to people for reasons. Alright, let's bite this guy so he stops running away. Are we coming on that SS strike rank, Volug? I mean, like... 
what, 15 to 20 percent or something like that? Like, slowly but surely. Can you reach? No. Uh, we could reach Mrarum, I guess, so we can have Mrarum get a little bit closer. Not that it really matters, but XP for Ra Raphael, I, I, I guess. Don't worry, Liliana, we got you. Shove. Alright, Soth versus the Wyvern Knight. Uh, he needs a crit, or we can just have Vika come in and kill. I'm fine with either. Alright, Vika comes in and kills. I'm, like I said, I'm fine with that. Gauge just in time. So, what's she at? She's at twenty seven, so it's a uh, thirty seven, forty seven, fifty, sixty seven, possibly. Uh, 77. Do I just... Do I just XP grind Micaiah? Ooh, I can... I can maybe, just maybe, get her a level if I grind her out on this one. I don't know why I'm doing this, but... I'm doing... Oh, I should probably heal her, by the way, actually. You know, one of those things you should probably do. So that she can, uh, continue to sacrifice for people. If I can get Raphael over there, it'd be a lot easier because he can dance for her. Can you shove Volu for me? No. I'm gonna pretend we're AI levels of bad and we're just gonna all gather around the healers. I probably could have moved Vika, actually. Oh well. There. Vika's moved. Poor priest, he's like, I don't even know what I'm doing here right now. Make sure she doesn't have Soth. Yeah, I know, I keep changing how I pronounce it. What are you gonna do? Sue me. I usually pronounce it soft, but every now and then I catch myself going south. I don't know why. Oh, probably should have danced. Actually, we need to shove you. Shove. Can you shove him? He's pretty lightweight, right? Shove him. Shove. That's as far as we can go for now. Oh, no! Don't heal Volug! That's Micaiah's job! Run away! Don't let him heal you! So if I put six, no, if I put five HP is 28, and then it's 18 is 46, versus if I do 18 now, it's uh, 41, and then another reason. So I get more heals if I purposely leave her weak and heal him. All right, we gotta shove him up. Shove! Shove! Out of the way! Raphael needs to... Well, I guess fine, talk. Who cares? Alright. Figure! Sacrifice! Oh, we're totally getting that level up. Tormite, you can get out of the way, by the way. Let's do that. Oh, shit! No, stop healing Soth! That was my fault. Soth, get over here. Raphael's trying to heal you.
And I can double heal Soth if I do it this way. Oh, no, I can't. I can't do math. It's fine, though. I can heal Mararin more. Actually, what we can do... We can figure Makaya. Optimal sacrificing strats here. This is definitely one of the dumbest things I've done in a while. Are we going to get the level up, though? I don't know if we are. Oh, we're getting the level up. Because he takes two heals to get to full. Alright, we got the level up. Got there. Totally worth the waste of the time this was. Alright, here we go, level 15. Or not 15, I wish it was 15. 13. More speed! There we go! Makaya, not gonna as likely to get doubled. She still will get doubled, but not as likely. Um, actually, I kind of want to let Olu get the kill for the strike rank. But no, Vika wants that level up. We're, we're gonna get Vika the level up. Why? I don't know. Vika's fucking terrible, and she doesn't show up again until part 4, but we're gonna give her that level up so she survives part 4, I guess? I don't know. I'm not thinking too hard about this one. I just thought it'd be funny to give Vika a kill. Didn't really get that much XP from it anyways. Alright, well that was a huge waste of time. I hope you appreciated it. Fun. I had fun, but it was a huge waste of time. Although you get still get a bunch of bonus XP. Hard mode's too easy. I really wish I hadn't screwed this up during the, uh... During the setup and put it on hard mode. I really wish it was Maniac. It would have been much better. Hardly feels like a true Iron Man on hard mode. Still is, but just, you know, kind of sucks that it's... Pass scroll. Nice, nice. Alright, see, this is where I wish I had the Light Rune. I wanted the Light Rune for this chapter. Do I have a spare palm? No. Anything cool? Another hand axe? Um. Fuck it. I got. The Don Brigade has nothing but money. They can afford to buy some cool stuff every now and then. Wind Edge. Or Sire could definitely get away with that. Statue frag? That's kind of a waste. Forge, can I make steel weapons yet? I can. I'll wait till next chapter though, because they'll still be able to forge steel weapons next chapter. I can get into Jill. Alright, Micaiah. We got a lot of bonus XP. Do I just get you to 15? Actually doesn't use that much to get you to 15. Didn't cap anything yet. Alright, we're gonna get to 15. We'll see what she looks like at 15. If she got good XP for or good stats at 15, I might go up a little bit higher. Like 16, 17 type thing. Okay, yeah. That's what you're gonna get when you don't have any stats capped. Well, we capped magic, so at the very least we get one additional stat. Um, what is it going to be? I think it's... Skill? Is it skill or HP? I think it's her next most likely to get now that she's got magic capped. The HP could make all the difference. It does cost me 1200 Bex. Go all the way to 20, that'd be funny. Um... Let's see if she can get one HP proc. That literally could make the difference. It honestly could. Or speed. I'm also that's 
prevents her from getting doubled. That's also very good. Because now she has 12, so they need to have 16 speed to double her. I don't know if anyone besides Jared has enough speed to double her with 12. That might be enough to save her. She still gets one shot, I think. Although, four defense isn't terrible. But... God, the Dom Brigade is so hurting for XP, though. So, like, giving it to Micaiah really sucks like this. I really would like one more point of HP, though. That would be really nice. Get HP and defense, that'd be fantastic. Uh... Beats a lot of my backs. I think we're fine. I think we're gonna be fine. He says as he's about to go into the game over chapter. Wish I had the light rune. I have the perfect idea for how to cheese this chapter with a light rune. But... I didn't pick it up. I accidentally killed the boss who had it. I think I'm gonna buy a wall now. There's one thing the Don Brigade has plenty of, it's money, so we may as well spend it. So what was it? The the Venonax had a might of eight on the brigand and he was doing sixteen damage to her. And that was at three defense, and she's at four now, so... What's the Steel Axe got in comparison? Eleven, so it's three more damage. So he was doing sixteen, so three more is nineteen, which is lethal, but she now has one more point of defense, which is... So... Her stats right now... Enable her to survive... The Brigands from last chapter with the Steel Axe. I don't know if that's enough to fight the soldiers we're about to go up against. I don't care. I'm giving her one more level. One more level. Please get HP. Please get HP. Preferably defense, but please get HP. Damn it. Why do you have to suck so hard, Micaiah? Oh, you gotta be a shitty unit. Alright, fine, fine. We're, we're I'm not gonna burn all my XP. You can still protect Micaiah easily enough on this chapter without completely hosing yourself. Choose unit. Uh, I think I want Micaiah this chapter. You know, actually, I'm feeling really confident. I'm gonna play only Micaiah this chapter. Pretty sure she's got this. Uh, anyways, that last chapter, uh, this chapter, this episode, however you want to phrase it, uh, it was a lot longer than I intended because I got greedy and a little, I don't know, like, dumbfounded, I don't know what the, I basically had a fucking brain fart and just decided to completely kill time doing absolutely nothing, which really wasted time in this episode, I apologize for that. I was just trying to have some fun. Hopefully you guys did too. And, uh, yeah, we'll start up and we'll fight the Black Knight in the next chapter here, so... Or not fight the Black Knight. That'd be... That'd be actually impossible. Micaiah cannot beat him at any stage in the game. Even a 2020 Micaiah can't. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we'll fight Jared and his army with the help of the Black Knight on the next chapter. So we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.